What's up guys, America Boy here, and I don't have much time, I have about 10 minutes before the server shuts down, Do uh, that's probably going to be them fixing the Tendering Rockhorn Summit experience glitch, and uh, by the way, I haven't used that glitch at all on my road to level 52, I just wanted to show you guys uh, the re the rest of the nature jewels cracked and damaged and the loot that I got uh, from running crags to level up solely so I showed you guys my loot from level 46 to 49 now I'm gonna show you guys what I gained the next three levels I'm not really showing you guys these damaged water jewels they're pretty cheap I have a few of those too, and it adds up. So basically, I have around double what I had last time because I leveled up three more levels. I have 172 crack nature jewels. Now, like I told you guys, everyone is farming crack tombs right now. So, damaged nature jewels and crack nature jewels, they're down in price, way down in price. They'll go back up after some people level up and stop farming crack. They'll just go up a little bit, but it matters. 172 crack nature jewels. If you wait, you could probably sell them for more. But 172 crack nature jewels, if you sold them for 200, only 200 coins each, you'd make 34.4 thousand. That's 40, 34K, not bad. And if you sold, let's say, the 63 Damage Nature Jewels that I've gotten, if you sold them for 600 gold each, you'd get 37.8K. That's 37,000 gold. Once again, not bad. If you added the combined profit from the crack nature jewels and the damaged ones, you'll have 62.2k. That's 62,000 gold in profit just from these nature jewels that dropped in the past six levels of leveling. That's almost 100,000 gold. And I'm pretty sure I'll make way over a hundred thousand gold in profit once I'm level 56 so you guys stay tuned you know I'm having a 1 million gold giveaway and that should be coming pretty soon so stay tuned for that comment subscribe down below like the video and as always see you next time